Hey, how's it going? Quick and dirty, how to uh, dress up a, a grid view. Um, basically, I have a page here that is um, a bunch of English, Ukrainian, and then the transliteration words. It's basically uh, a grid view that's hooked up to this vocabulary.xml, which you can, by the way, download this entire um, this entire application uh, at the link below, okay, in the more comments, uh, and or more about. So, if you go back to default.aspx, uh, you can see if we go ahead and test it, that grid view has got English words, Ukrainian words, and transliteration. Very boring. So we're going to dress that up, okay? And let me show you how to do that. So you have a folder in here which you download. Uh, it's called CSS, Cascading Style Sheet. There's a style sheet in there, and there's a couple of um, images that make it look good, okay? So we go back to default.aspx. We're going to go to uh, the source, and underneath your uh, title in the head, we're going to go ahead and say uh, link type. equals and we're going to go text.css I'm going to put in a ref or rel equals style sheet and then we want to put in our href which is a link to our style sheet and our style sheet is in folder css style.css okay oops so we just put that in here so we're going to go CSS folder uh, style dot CSS okay and we'll close that so that basically just points to our CSS folder style dot CSS got it and then in the uh, underneath the grid view uh, after data source go right after that bracket hit return and I'm going to go ahead and paste this in here. You can get all this information that I just pasted uh, in your default.aspx that you download in the link below. Okay, so that looks pretty good. We're going to save it. Let's go ahead and test it. <clears throat> and there you go. That spruces up your uh, your grid view. So that's how you attach a CSS style uh, to a grid view in ASP.NET 2013 Visual Studio. Thanks for watching.